myocardial infarction, commonly referred to as heart attack, is the sudden death of part of the heart muscle due to loss of blood flow. This occurs when one of the coronary arteries, the arteries that supply blood to the heart, is blocked. The blockage is commonly due to atherosclerosis, the accumulation of cholesterol plaques, or fat deposits, on the wall of blood vessels. As the plaque builds up, the vessel becomes narrow, restricting blood flow. Under stress, the plaque may rupture, and this may trigger formation of blood clot on top of the plaque, leading to a complete blockage. When this happens in a coronary artery, the downstream patch of the myocardium dies from lack of oxygen. Weakened heart muscle may disrupt electrical activity of the heart and subsequently cause cardiac arrest. Coronary angioplasty is a non-surgical procedure used to open narrowed or blocked coronary arteries. It can also be performed as an emergency treatment for myocardial infarction. The first part of the procedure is to localize the site of blockage. This part is called coronary angiogram. A guiding catheter is inserted through the femoral artery at the groin and threaded all the way to the aorta. The tip of the catheter is placed at the beginning of the coronary artery to be investigated. A radio-opaque dye is injected through the catheter into the coronary artery. This enables real-time visualization of the artery using X-ray imaging. The narrowed part of an artery would appear as a bottleneck on an X-ray image. After the location of blockage is identified, angioplasty can begin. A guide wire with a deflated balloon is inserted and pushed to the site of blockage. The balloon is inflated to crush the plaque. At the end of the procedure, the balloon is deflated and removed together with all catheters and guide wire. In some cases, a stent is inserted together with the balloon, inflated, and left on place of the plaque to keep the artery open permanently. Anabara, committed to delivering quality Medicare at affordable cost, contact us to get a free estimate or a second opinion.